Hello everyone. Let's hope that this is working. So if you can hear me, please shout it out. That's always my concern if the voice is there. So I'm pulling my device here just to check if I get notification. I love that. Get the notification on an email when I go live. How can you get that? That is simple. So you subscribe to my channel. And then after you subscribe to my channel, you hit that little bell there and you set your notification. So before YouTube used to send notification every time I would post a video. Now it's only when it's live. So make sure you do that. So here we go. I can hear you. Awesome. So um, I don't know how many of you are um, coming here from Facebook. And if some of you are mainly watching me on YouTube and you're wondering what is create on the fly. So my mouth is dry. One minute here. Cannot flick my lips uh, the whole time. I'm going to have a sip of water. Sonia et Guy Jarvet de Saint-André. Well, that is where I'm from. Try to remember Gervais. I went to school with some, um, and what was his name? Pierre Gervais. Um, it was another one too. Um, gosh, I did Bible study with them. Mm, cannot remember. So it's kind of fun to see some familiar name. So, okay, what I was saying. So um, I used to be live on Thursday night on Facebook. I've been encountered problem with the volume. It depends which device they were using and so on. And this has been going on off and on. And in the past month, I guess that it's been horrible, not just on my channel in general. So I'm like, why not switching my create on the fly right here on YouTube? So everybody can jump on on YouTube. You don't have to be part of the community of Facebook to join YouTube or everybody can go. So my best advice is um, to subscribe. Hit that subscribe button right below here. And then you're going to click on that little bell to set your notification. So anytime I am live, you're going to get notification in your email. So now this is a permanent move here. It's not just this week or next week. I decide I was moving my create on the fly on YouTube. So on Thursday night, and I'm going to say most Thursday nights. So if I'm gone camping or if uh, uh, I'm out on vacation, so stuff like that, then I'm going to make a memo on my blog or also on Facebook, I'm going to say it will be no create on the fly tonight because I'm unavailable. But most time, uh, Thursday night, I will be live at 6 p.m. Mountain Time. So that is 5, uh, West, the West Coast there, uh, Pacific Time, 6, <laughs> okay, gather my thought. Okay, let's start that again. Five Pacific time, six mountain time, seven central time, and eight eastern time. I used to say that so quick, and tonight, I don't know, I just get blank here. So, uh, so that's, that's, in a nutshell, create on the fly. Also, create on the fly most, like tonight, I know what I'm going to be doing, but most time... I come live and it the titles say it all. I create on the fly. Uh, I'm going to make you choose the colors. I'm going to make you choose sometimes the stamp set and so on. I have no clue what I'm going to create till I start creating it. So it's very different compared to a class and my regular videos. So keep that in mind, okay? So now, with that being said, tonight I was inspired by Holly and it's a turtle card it would be perfect for valentine's it would be perfect to send somebody just because you love them it don't have to be valentine's but it fit perfectly there so let me flip this down 
and we're going to get started. Here we go. Perfect. So, now, yeah, I think we can see this good. So, the stamp set I'm using, I'm using Turtle Friend. And it does have some grass right here. But I choose to incorporate another stamp set right here. This one, I wanted that grass there. That's Easter Friend. So this, it's in the mini catalog. And uh, this one, it's in the annual catalog. Also, in the description below, I get the link for all the supplies that I am using. So, with that being said, we're going to do the mirror image. This is not new. I get a few videos about mirror image, but we're going to do mirror image again tonight. So we're going to go ahead, oops, I need to put myself a little bit, a little table on the side where, when I go live and I got it. I just have to dig it out and I will do that. Okay. Um, I, we're going to take that little turtle here. I want to share something with you. Um, I discovered that today, and I think it's very important that I share that with you all. So, let's say you take your turtle here, and you're going to put that on your stamps, your uh, block. I bet you saw what I did, right? It was wrong. So, let me show you what I mean by that paper here so I'm gonna go ahead and stem this here and then see how this form it is and then I'm gonna try to punch it uh oh it's not matching but it's it's matching right okay let me share with you what you want to do let me get my washi washi here so, uh, sometimes the case, it's not exactly the size of the stamp set. So, keep that in mind. This one, happen it is. So, you can put it, so the raised part, this place that stamp going to go down. This one fit perfect. But a lot of time, this one, the case depends on the size of the stamp set. That wouldn't be the case. So, you can go inside and then again you're gonna oh this won't work so you if that wouldn't be the same size i would just drop it so by dropping it you won't stretch the legs or the body or the head and so on now you're going to take your block put it on and then we know we get the perfect match okay now we're going to take a i got a um, crumb cake here I'm using different color than Ollie, and I change mine. I mean, the the main uh, idea of the card is from I, Ollie, but I change my colors and so on. So I'm going to go ahead and stamp this with Early Espresso. We're going to go ahead, smack that here, remove that, and then we're going to stamp this. And you know what? I should add it more on the other side. That's okay. And now we're going to leave this one aside. We're going to move this here. Now I need another one that it's not stamped. Okay, so go ahead, punch another one. And I need one at this end because I want it more to the right. And you're going to understand that in a minute why I want it to the right. It's because it's uh, easier to do uh, any kind of on the stamparatus, not right on the edge. So that's why I wanted to move that. Okay. Now, this is just uh, one of the paper. I just keep that there to keep my surface clean. You're going to use the silicone mat. Put that right here. 
Now, uh, let me wash this here so I don't get my uh, end all filthy before I start. Huh. I had the washy washy, I just use it. Oh, I must have a little glass in my room this tonight. Oh, die. Right here. That's funny. Thank you all that are sharing with your friends. I so, so appreciate you when you do that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. When you tell your friend about me or come and join, that's how I grow my business. So thank you, thank you a million. Okay, now you're going to take your stamp and you're going to, I like to really lift this up so then I know it's exactly in the opening there. Okay, so you're going to put your stamp inside your mask here the, what we just did you're going to put it down now you're going to close this open this up make sure i i don't use the the magnet i'm not a magnet fan okay so that's why i like to have everything square in my corner so even if it move i can move it there okay Now tap, 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 and, oh, yep, stamp. Now you're going to take the punch out, the, not the one that we had the, oh, come here, Hugh. Not the one that we stamp on it, because that's the other one, okay? The plain one, and we're going to put that at the top, and just rub your finger. Also, what I like to do, I like to come back with my stamp and it's just push right, make sure it's really pronounced there. Now I'm going to look at that. Oh, see, I'm missing some at the top and so on. So I want a second layer. That's easy. You just keep on keeping it in the corner here. Some of you like to use uh, the magnet. Power to you. I'm just, the magnet put a cramp in my style. So I have to move it if I do more than one and so on. So uh, I like it without the magnet. I know some of you, the magnet, it's a big deal. Whatever you like, it's no right and wrong when it comes to uh, paper crafting. Now you're going to take this again, put it right down here, press that, and then we're going to go ahead and press this again. So we get our mirror image. That's what we just done here. Open it up. Remember, this is not the side we want. It's this side. See? Boom! Kablooey! We get both. And you're going to say, well, why you didn't take just the stamp? You cannot reverse the stamp, right? So you have to use the, the silicone sheet. Okay, now what you're going to do with this, the way that I like to do it... <clears throat> Well, it disappeared again. Okay. Well, usually I take a, a BB wipe. I used my last one today, but I thought I'd keep it. I just use my stamping mess. You can take water too. I just like to take my stamping mess, and now I'm going to use my inky rag, and boom, I wash it. That's it. It's ready to rock and roll. Always keep a silicone sheet in this. So now this is done. It happened that the shell to go with uh, the turtle, it don't matter. It fit perfect. So we don't have to do the mirror image for the shell. So what I mean by that, I'm just laughing to myself today. I turn one side, the thing it's not there, turn the other side. It's just crazy. Okay. Now, we're going to go ahead with the shell. Here we go. And then we're going to use, um, whatchamacallit, you know what, I want to move that out of the way. This card here was done with Hello Friendly, or Friendly Hello, uh, from Celebration. That I done that live, uh, this Tuesday I was live at lunchtime. So uh, it's all two by four. So it's like a one sheet wonder. Well, you could do a one sheet wonder, but that's all part of celebration. So don't forget, 
if you place an order of $50 and above, you get to choose one. This one, it's with a choice of $100 because you get the stamp set and the paper. So I add that on the side. Some of it was not finished. I finished that. So I wanted to share with, uh, with you all this. That was done this week on um, lunchtime. So again, if you subscribe to my channel, you would get notified. So that you can... Uh, find it in my channel just this week so you don't have far to go a dry eraser to uh, use in the stamparatus hmm never thought of that hmm I have to remember that Jocelyn okay now we're going to take the, the shell I had smacked that there very cockeyed there and we're going to use soft suede. Don't add that color here. Why is that? Here we go. Soft suede. So we're going to go ahead and and because it's photopolymer I like to have my foam. So we're going to put the foam. You know where I'm going with this now, right? See at those little cutie pie and then right here. Okay, now we're going to dress them up a little bit, okay? So, I ran out of space, like always. Now, I got crumb cake, light or dark? Which one? It is dark. So, I got crumb cake, dark. And I'm going to color, uh, yeah, I can... No, it was not crumb cake dark. I know which color. It's ivory. Ivory that I use for the body. So we're going to color R and M with ivory. Okay, don't, don't color the little toes, okay? That's going to be something else. We're going to put her some nail polish. And, um, okay, just the body and the legs, okay? Just the body and the legs, good ivory. I just want a different tone. We're going to have a few tone of the turtle here. And we get so many turtle here. Um, we go and feed them just down the road here. They're fun. They are so fun to watch. Okay, now we're going to use the crumb cake. Oh, one second. Here we go. Had a tough time pulling that cat. So the crumb cake, we're going to color the little tail with crumb cake. And this is the, was that the dark? Yes, right? Yeah, the dark. So color the tail of her. And for M, we're going to color the little, uh, I call that the toes there. Going to color that in crumb cake dark. And then all on the shell, I'm going to do a little bit of shadowing. So just add a little bit on each pattern there. Just to, it's really going to add some depth to this. You're going to see when we're done. It's kind of amazing to see what a little bit of shadowing or these little add-on that I'm doing, what it does to that little turtle. So I'm just adding on, I go all on the same side, so this is all on the right. Here we go. It takes a little bit of time, but I think, see how it changed the whole thing, see between the two? 
I see how the dog behave around them. Around the turtle, well, that's, you cannot have those two without the leash. That wouldn't be good. Mm -mm -mm -mm. No, 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 no. We would have a fiasco. I know they would get bit because a lot of it, it's the snapping turtle. So, yeah. And some of them, I mean, they're big like, a tippet like almost a dog. I mean, we get humongous. You know, everything is bigger in Texas, but seriously, we get humongous turtle here. It's a KOA just down the road from me, and yeah. But you don't want to go feed the turtle like KOA. They're going to kick you out there if you're not a, a camper there. Uh, I don't know if it was Ollie that we got kicked out when she came to visit or Glenda, but yeah. We did get kicked out. Here we go. Is that cute? So it really, I mean, it's just one more little thing, but it add a lot. Okay, so we said this was a girl. We're going to put her some lipstick. What the heck? Why not? We're going to dress her to the nine. So I got Mary, uh, Melon Mumbo Delight, okay? So I'm going to put some lipstick here. And we're going to match the toenail. It's she went to get a pedicure today. Look at that. Is that fun? I think so. Look at that. Boom. So she got a little bit of... Uh, polish now i'm using the black marker i'm using the fine tip okay and then we're gonna put some little eyelashes eyelashes there ta-da oh flipping cute look at that See that? How amazing she is. I think she's just way cute. Okay, now we get that done. She made me happy. So now we need um, we need a bow tie for him and a bow tie for her. So we're going to do a bow tie in Flirty Flamingo. Kablooey. Oops, we need the whole thing. Well, what the? Is it the way it is? I think so. Let me see. Here we go. Okay, now we got flirty. Oh, my Anne went right in it. And now we're going to go um, Misty Moonlight. And we're going to have a little bow tie for Anne. And voila. Okay. Now, let's chop that up. Okay, we're going to cut this. Remember, you don't move the scissors. You, I mean, the scissors open and close. You, the uh, left hand, move the paper, make it super easy to end cut. I know some of you are allergic to uh, end cut, and I like it. I'm sorry. It's no dye for this. Maybe if we get a, a, another dye in something with a little bow in the Christmas, I bet if we look hard, we could find one. Here we go. Okay, now that is done. I need glue dots. If I would be a glue dots, hmm, I'm exactly where I should be. Okay, we're going to put uh, the little bow tie on M. And the glue dot's a little, a little bit bigger, so I just squeeze it in the back, okay? That's it. And we're going to put that right here. Oh, ow. It is so cute. And I am not uh, one with cutie. Uh, don't do a lot of cutie, but this is... You know what? I say that, but lately I've been doing that little ladybug and these turtles. I guess it's growing on me, right? Now, er, it's in the head. Voila. You need a top to add our baseball cap. Yeah, that would be fun. Okay, 
We're going to leave that there. We're going to use a piece that uh, measure, um, it is four and a half by three and a quarter. Four and a half, three and a quarter. We're going to put some color on this. Get a scrappy paper here. We're going to start with, um, at the bottom, with green. There we go. Just a little bit. We don't need that much, okay? Okay, now I'm going to keep that open just in case I want it back. Then the top's going to be with balmy blue. And then we're going to push that down. See how I build that? Push it down. Then I'm going to go. So I want darker at the top, and here, the horizon, I want to keep that kind of light. Oh, she will get the pearl necklace, trust me. That's going to go at the end. Yep, she will get a pearl necklace. There we go. So you see how it's lighter here? That's the way that I like that. Now, with the friend, uh, Easter friend, we're going to take the grass. And let's put that there. Oops, oops, oops. Where'd that come from? Okay. Nope, the grass don't fit there. Okay, I need something else. Okay, it fits here. Now we're going to take the grass and we're going to stamp that. Like I said, in the turtle set, you got the grass here, okay? I just like the fluffy grass more. That's it. I'm going to stamp on the blue side. Don't want to do that. Now we're going to go ahead, do some grass. See, as you go higher, you want lighter. Just the full illusion, right? And that looked pretty good. Oh, maybe right here and a little more. Et voila. Okay, now we're ready to build that. Now we're going to mount that on real red. Well, could you guess I'm live, ran out of tape. That, that's typical, but I'm ready tonight. I got another one on the other table. Here we go. Been a while I didn't do that. Usually every time I was live. And we're going to put that right there. I'm working upside down tonight. Why? I have no clue. Let's flip that back. Now, my card base, it is... Um, Five and a half by eight and a half score at four and a quarter. Yeah, see, Betty's seeing all kind of IDs. Yeah, the sky is the limit. You can dress them up. You can, for St. Patty's Day, put a little shamrock, name it, right? Anniversary card, absolutely. That's what I'm saying. It's not just Valentine's. Absolutely not. Now, this is what I was like perfect when I saw Ollie using that that's what sold me you are totally loved oh how stinking cute is that is that cockeye okay so um you know when I was live on uh, you, uh, Facebook doing create on the fly on Sunday, I announced the winner. Well, now, what I'm going to do is the following week, I will announce the winner of the previous week, okay? So next week, I will announce the winner of this card. So then you get all week to comment, and boom. 
Foxy. Oh, it is so cute. You know what? I want more grass on this though, the one inside. Let me uh, put some grass here. Just something inside the card that flew with the front of the card, right? So you get plenty of space to write whatever you want to write. So this is going to go inside. Bluey. Okay, and then where's my journal win? My little girl. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm um, panicking here. She gets stuck on something. I'm sure she did. Yeah. She flew on the other table. How did I know that? Okay. Whoever was saying pearl or rhinestone, whatever, I get the pearl. That was, like I said, that come from Ollie. So here is my little Timbits here. So the guy going to have dimensional. And the girl's because she's going to have the rhinestone, she's going to be directly, so it's going to be friendlier to a uh, male. I just like to put, uh, you know, dimensional and rhinestone or an embellishment on top of that. It make it very bulky and a lot of time we need extra, uh, what you may call it, ex yeah, extra that, whatever it's called postage okay now this here gonna be directly down that was my belly that growl and i ate supper tonight i'm gonna put that right here oh they are so cute okay now we're gonna take four pearls and the way that i like to do it i like to do it top i mean one side and then at the other side and then go down two more there three was not enough three didn't look like a necklace for some reason i think so see now it curved down is that cute okay we're not done and now we're going to use real red you see you're going to see mine that i did earlier there so, like I said, most Thursday, though, you won't see one. I don't even have one that i done before. I just wanted to refresh my mind how to do the uh, mirror image. I didn't do that for a while. Now, I'm going to use the hearts here. That it's in that uh, stamp set, the turtle stamp set. And I ink once, okay? Ink once. We're going to stamp lift and I'm gonna go here stamp lift and stamp voila so it changed poof is that cool so that is it how cute is it I think Ollie thank you so much for inspiring me I absolutely love this I think it's the cutest little turtle out there now here is the one that i done earlier see about the same uh, yeah i changed the background i thought i wanted uh, the crumb cake so stinking cute that's what i say too so stinking cute so you know i use quite a bit of product for this right i use two stamp set i use the stamp apparatus uh, one two three four five six seven um ink pad and so on well here don't run away don't run away i get a little offer for you why not joining my team for a discount shopper you heard me right you can join my team you can join to be in the business like i do or you can join for the discount to be a discount shopper what is a discount shopper is anytime after you join anytime that you place an order as long as you stay active you get a minimum of 20 percent discount 
if you order it's 150 and above not only you get your discount but you're getting the stamping rewards too on page 198 I think it's 178 in the catalog so you can I call that double dip so is that awesome yeah 170 170 so uh, what is it to join my team well right now during celebration it's a sweet time it's always a sweet time a sweet deal but during celebration you get more a little bit more so right now for $99 you get to choose $125 of product of your choice that can be from the animal catalog the mini catalog you can choose bits here bit there it's okay what you cannot choose is the hostess that's the stamping rewards uh, stamp set or product and you cannot choose the celebration stamp set the rest it's a fair game you can use get the embossing machine stamp and cut emboss machine you can get the stamp apparatus all the way to 125 dollars and then during celebration you get two not one but two extra stamp set of your choice doesn't matter the value you get two extra stamp set so you can it's going to be a value of almost two hundred dollars or more depending on the stamp set you choose and that's going to ship to you for free again the two stamp set you're going to choose for free cannot be a celebration or cannot be a stamping rewards stamps the rest it's fair game so 99 dollars free shipping and boom you get quite a deal and what happened if you decide okay i started i don't want to you know stay active you become my customer all that it's yours you don't have to worry about anything it's no commitment uh, uh, attached to stay active you're going to say well what is it to stay active that is $300 quarterly don't run away $300 quarterly sound a lot that is before your discount so with your discount that's the minimum $20 discount I mean 20% discount so that now you're down to $240 because $300 20% $60 make $240 divide that by three because quarterly it's three months you're down to $80 a month to get your discount to be a discount shopper so if you get any question please go at frenchystamps.com I get a Q&A there also please contact me I would love to welcome you on the team anybody my mouth is so dry anybody of in the U.S. 18 um, year of age and above can join my team so that's about it so i'm glad you guys like what i present tonight i think they were so so stinking cute right i think so look at that yes so um till next time happy stamping don't forget to get notification when i go live because now i'm going to be live quite more often on youtube that create on the fly change here make sure right below you subscribe and then after you subscribe you hit that little bell and set your notification on so that is it my friend till next time happy stamping all the supplies that i used to it's in the link below for tonight have a lovely one my friend bye bye for now